Welcome to Hollywood Inside 1960s. Today, we delve into a sobering topic as we explore the lives of celebrities who, despite their fame and fortune, found themselves facing homelessness or financial ruin. From glamorous red carpets to the harsh realities of life on the streets, these stories shed light on the unpredictable nature of fame and fortune in the entertainment industry. Join us as we uncover the untold struggles behind the glitz and glamour of Hollywood. Number 30. Jan Michael Vincent, once a prominent actor known for his roles in popular TV series like Airwolf and notable films including Big Wednesday and The Mechanic, tragically faced financial ruin and homelessness later in life. Despite achieving significant success in his career during the 1970s and 1980s, Vincent struggled with personal demons, including substance abuse issues, which ultimately led to a downturn in his career and financial instability. His lavish lifestyle and legal troubles drained his finances, leading to bankruptcy. Additionally, Vincent suffered from health problems, including alcohol-related issues and a severe car accident in 1996 that left him with permanent injuries and exacerbated his financial and personal struggles. These challenges culminated in Vincent's eventual homelessness and reclusive lifestyle before his passing in 2019 due to cardiac arrest. Number 29. Amanda Peterson was a promising young actress who rose to fame in the 1980s, best known for her role as Cindy Mancini in the teen comedy film, Can't Buy Me Love, alongside Patrick Dempsey. Peterson's charming performance in the movie earned her critical acclaim and a growing fan base. However, despite her initial success, Peterson struggled with personal demons, including substance abuse issues. These struggles took a toll on her career and finances, leading to a downward spiral. As her career declined, Peterson faced financial difficulties, including bankruptcy and debt. Unfortunately, Amanda Peterson passed away in 2015 at the age of 43. Her death was attributed to an accidental overdose, highlighting the tragic consequences of her battles with addiction and financial instability. Number 28. Dana Plato was a beloved actress best known for her role as Kimberly Drummond on the popular TV sitcom, Different Strokes, in the late 1970s and early 1980s. Initially, Plato's career showed great promise, and she gained widespread recognition for her performance on the show. However, as she grew older, she struggled to find substantial acting roles, and her career began to decline. This decline, coupled with personal struggles, including addiction issues and financial mismanagement, led to significant financial difficulties for Plato. Despite efforts to revive her career and stabilize her finances, Plato faced numerous challenges and setbacks. Tragically, Dana Plato passed away in 1999 at the age of 34. Her death was ruled as a result of a drug overdose. Plato's struggles with addiction and financial instability serve as a poignant reminder of the challenges faced by many in the entertainment industry. Number 27. Randy Quaid is a seasoned actor known for his versatile performances in both comedic and dramatic roles. With a successful career spanning several decades, he garnered critical acclaim and numerous awards for his work in films like The Last Detail, The Paper, and Brokeback Mountain. However, despite his professional achievements, Quaid's life took a tumultuous turn due to a series of personal and legal troubles. Alongside his wife, Evie Quaid, he became embroiled in a string of legal issues, including vandalism charges and accusations of squatting in properties they did not own. These legal battles drained their finances, and the couple faced mounting debt and foreclosure threats. Their erratic behavior and frequent run-ins with the law further exacerbated their financial downfall. Despite attempts to revive his career, Randy Quaid struggled to regain stability, ultimately leading to financial ruin and a period of homelessness. His journey reflects the challenges of fame, legal entanglements, and financial mismanagement that can plague even the most successful entertainers. Number 28. 
Number 26. Corey Hyam was a Canadian actor who gained fame in the 1980s, starring in several popular films such as Lucas, The Lost Boys, and License to Drive. He was considered one of the most promising young actors of his generation. However, as he grew older, Hyam faced personal struggles, including addiction issues and financial mismanagement, which negatively impacted his career. His addiction problems led to erratic behavior and a decline in his professional opportunities. Consequently, Hyam encountered financial difficulties, struggling to maintain stability and support himself. Despite attempts at rehabilitation and career comebacks, he continued to battle with addiction and financial instability. Tragically, Corey Hyam passed away in 2010 at the age of 38. His death was attributed to pneumonia, with drugs playing a contributing factor. Haim's life serves as a poignant reminder of the challenges faced by child actors in Hollywood and the devastating impact of addiction and financial instability. Number 25. Danny Bonaducci gained fame as a child actor for his role as Danny Partridge on the popular sitcom The Partridge Family in the early 1970s. However, as he transitioned into adulthood, Bonaducci faced numerous personal struggles that led to financial instability. Despite his early success, Bonaducci battled addiction and legal issues, which took a toll on his career and finances. He struggled to find steady work in Hollywood and faced challenges in managing his finances effectively. Bonaducci's financial troubles were exacerbated by his tumultuous personal life, including multiple divorces and legal battles. Despite attempts at career comebacks and reality television appearances, he continued to face financial difficulties. Benaducci's story serves as a cautionary tale about the challenges of transitioning from child stardom to adulthood in the entertainment industry and the importance of financial responsibility. Number 24. Lisa Robin Kelly was an American actress best known for her role as Laurie Foreman on the popular sitcom That 70s Show. In the early seasons of the show, Kelly received acclaim for her performance and gained recognition for her portrayal of the rebellious older sister. However, as the series progressed, Kelly faced personal challenges, including struggles with substance abuse. These issues affected her work on the show, leading to conflicts with producers and ultimately resulting in her departure from that 70s show. Subsequently, Kelly's career declined, and she struggled to secure acting roles. Alongside her professional challenges, Kelly battled addiction, which contributed to financial instability. Despite efforts to overcome her substance abuse issues, including multiple rehab stints, Kelly's struggles persisted. Tragically, Lisa Robin Kelly passed away in 2013 at the age of 43. Her death was attributed to accidental overdose, highlighting the devastating consequences of addiction and the toll it can take on one's life and career. Number 23. Brett Butler rose to fame in the 1990s as the star of the hit sitcom, Grace Under Fire, where she played a single mother trying to make ends meet. The show's success catapulted Butler to stardom, and she became one of the most recognizable faces on television. However, despite her initial success, Butler faced personal struggles, including addiction issues and financial mismanagement, which eventually led to her downfall. Her battles with substance abuse affected her work and relationships, resulting in the cancellation of Grace Under Fire and a decline in her career prospects. As her career waned, Butler's financial situation deteriorated, and she faced significant debt and financial instability. Despite efforts to revive her career and address her personal issues, including stints in rehab, Butler continued to face challenges. Her story serves as a cautionary tale about the dangers of fame, addiction, and financial mismanagement in Hollywood. Number 22. 
Lonnie O'Grady was an actress best known for her role as Mary Bradford in the television series, Eight is Enough, which aired in the late 1970s and early 1980s. Despite her success on the show, O'Grady faced personal struggles that eventually led to financial difficulties. She battled with mental health issues, including bipolar disorder, which impacted her ability to work consistently in Hollywood. As her career prospects diminished, O'Grady encountered financial instability, struggling to maintain her lifestyle and support herself. Additionally, her mental health challenges exacerbated her financial situation, as she faced mounting medical bills and expenses related to treatment. Despite efforts to address her mental health issues and stabilize her finances, O'Grady's struggles persisted. Tragically, she passed away in 2001 at the age of 46. Her death was ruled as an accidental overdose, highlighting the tragic consequences of her battles with mental illness and financial instability. Number 21. Aaron Carter gained fame as a pop and hip-hop singer in the late 1990s and early 2000s, achieving success with hit songs like Aaron's Party, Come Get It, and I Want Candy. As a child star, Carter enjoyed immense popularity and financial success. However, as he transitioned into adulthood, Carter faced various personal struggles that contributed to financial instability. He battled addiction issues and encountered legal troubles, including multiple arrests for DUI and drug possession. These challenges, combined with mismanagement of finances, led to a decline in his career and financial troubles. Carter struggled to maintain his lifestyle and pay off debts, ultimately leading to financial difficulties and setbacks. Despite attempts at career comebacks and efforts to address his personal issues, including stints in rehab, Carter continued to face challenges with addiction and financial instability. His story serves as a cautionary tale about the pressures and pitfalls of child stardom and the importance of financial responsibility. Number 20. Mindy McCready was a country music singer who rose to fame in the mid-1990s with her debut album, 10,000 Angels. Her talent and charm captivated audiences, leading to a promising career in the music industry. However, as McCready's career progressed, she faced numerous personal struggles that ultimately led to financial instability. Substance abuse issues and mental health challenges plagued her life, affecting her ability to maintain a successful career and manage her finances responsibly. Despite achieving early success with hits like, Guys Do It All The Time, and, Maybe He'll Notice Her Now, McCready's personal demons overshadowed her professional achievements. Legal troubles and failed relationships further compounded her financial woes, leaving her in dire straits. Despite attempts at rehabilitation and a few comeback efforts, McCready's struggles persisted, and tragically, she passed away in 2013 at the age of 37. Her death was ruled as a suicide, highlighting the devastating consequences of addiction and financial instability in the entertainment industry. Number 19. Bobby Driscoll was a talented child actor who gained fame in the 1940s and 1950s, best known for his roles in Disney films such as Song of the South and Treasure Island. His cherubic looks and natural acting abilities endeared him to audiences, earning him critical acclaim and numerous awards, including an Academy Juvenile Award. However, as Driscoll transitioned into adulthood, he struggled to find success in the film industry and faced personal demons that led to financial instability. Despite his early success, Driscoll encountered difficulties securing roles as he grew older and his career waned. Substance abuse issues further compounded his challenges, contributing to financial troubles and legal problems. Tragically, Bobby Driscoll passed away in 1968 at the age of 31, and his body remained unidentified for two years until he was recognized by a fingerprint match. His death was attributed to heart failure caused by his struggles with addiction. Driscoll's story serves as a cautionary tale about the perils of child stardom and the importance of addressing mental health issues in the entertainment industry.
Number 18. John Drew Barrymore, son of the legendary actor John Barrymore and father to actress Drew Barrymore, was an actor himself who experienced the highs and lows of fame. Born into a renowned acting dynasty, Barrymore initially found success in Hollywood during the 1950s and 1960s, starring in films like While the City Sleeps and High Lonesome. However, despite his early achievements, Barrymore's career was marred by personal struggles, including substance abuse and legal issues, which led to financial instability. His erratic behavior and unreliable work ethic made it challenging for him to secure steady acting roles, ultimately hindering his career progression. As a result, Barrymore faced financial difficulties and found himself in dire straits, unable to maintain a stable income. Despite occasional attempts to revive his career, including sporadic acting roles, Barrymore's personal battles continued to overshadow his professional endeavors. His story serves as a cautionary tale about the toll of addiction and personal demons on one's career and financial stability, even within a family of Hollywood royalty. Number 17. Todd Bridges is an actor best known for his role as Willis Jackson on the popular sitcom, Different Strokes, which aired from 1978 to 1986. As a child actor, Bridges experienced significant success and gained widespread recognition for his performance on the show. However, as he transitioned into adulthood, Bridges faced numerous personal struggles, including drug addiction and legal troubles, which impacted his career and financial stability. Despite efforts to overcome his challenges and revive his acting career, Bridges continued to encounter difficulties. His battles with addiction and legal issues contributed to financial hardships, and he faced periods of unemployment and financial instability. Bridges' story serves as a reminder of the challenges faced by former child actors in Hollywood and the importance of seeking support and resources to address personal struggles and maintain financial well-being. Number 16. Willie Ames was a former child star who achieved fame in the late 1970s and 1980s, best known for his roles as Tommy Bradford on the television series, Eight is Enough, and Buddy Lembeck on, Charles in Charge. Ames' early success as a teen heartthrob propelled him to stardom, and he enjoyed a period of popularity in Hollywood. However, as he grew older, Ames faced personal struggles that led to financial difficulties. He battled addiction issues and struggled to find steady work in the entertainment industry, which ultimately affected his financial stability. Despite attempts to revive his career and overcome his personal demons, including stints in rehab, Ames continued to face challenges. His financial woes escalated, and he filed for bankruptcy in 2008, citing debts of over $350,000. Am's story serves as a cautionary tale about the pitfalls of fame and the importance of addressing personal struggles early on to maintain financial stability in the entertainment industry. Number 15. Marvin Gaye was a legendary American singer, songwriter, and record producer, known for his groundbreaking contributions to soul music. Rising to prominence in the 1960s and 1970s, Gaye's smooth and emotive voice, coupled with his socially conscious lyrics, made him one of the most influential artists of his time. Hits like, I Heard It Through the Grapevine, What's Going On, and Sexual Healing, remain timeless classics. Despite his immense talent and success, Gay faced numerous personal struggles throughout his life, including battles with addiction and mental health issues. Additionally, he experienced significant financial difficulties due to mismanagement of his finances and disputes with record labels. These challenges took a toll on Gay both professionally and personally. Tragically, Marvin Gaye's life was cut short when he was shot and killed by his father, Marvin Gaye Sr., in April 1984, just one day before his 45th birthday. His untimely death shocked the world and left an indelible mark on the music industry. Gay's legacy as a musical genius and cultural icon endures, 
but his story also serves as a poignant reminder of the complexities and struggles that often accompany fame and success. Number 14. Aran Barkley was a renowned professional boxer who achieved great success in his career, notably winning world titles in multiple weight classes. However, despite his athletic prowess and fame, Barkley faced significant financial challenges later in life. Following his retirement from boxing, he struggled to maintain financial stability, experiencing a series of setbacks that ultimately led to his homelessness. Barkley's financial crisis stemmed from various factors, including mismanagement of funds, lack of long-term financial planning, and difficulty transitioning to life outside of the ring. Despite his past triumphs in the boxing world, Barkley's later years were marked by adversity as he grappled with homelessness and financial insecurity. Number 13. Jennifer Lee, a talented filmmaker, rose to prominence with her work on the animated film, Frozen, which became a global sensation. Despite her initial success, Lee faced financial hardship following a series of unfortunate events. Due to a combination of personal and professional challenges, including costly legal disputes and failed projects, Lee's financial stability began to crumble. She struggled to secure funding for her creative endeavors, and her debts continued to mount. Eventually, the financial strain became overwhelming, leading Lee to declare bankruptcy. This downturn in her finances had a significant impact on her life and career, forcing her to reassess her priorities and make difficult decisions to rebuild her financial standing. Number 12. Natasha Lyonne, a talented actress known for her roles in Orange is the New Black and Russian Doll, faced significant financial turmoil despite her success in the entertainment industry. After achieving fame and critical acclaim, Lyonne encountered a series of personal struggles, including substance abuse issues and legal troubles, which took a toll on her finances. Additionally, mismanagement of funds and failed investments exacerbated her financial woes. Despite her efforts to regain stability, including seeking treatment and rehabilitation, the financial burden proved insurmountable. Eventually, Leon faced bankruptcy, marking a challenging period in her life and career. However, she persevered through these hardships, eventually finding her footing again in the industry and rebuilding her financial health. Number 11. Sly Stone, the iconic musician and frontman of Sly and the Family Stone, faced a tumultuous financial journey despite his immense success in the music industry. As a pioneer of funk and soul music, Sly Stone achieved widespread acclaim and popularity with hits like Everyday People and Thank You, Fallotin Me Be Mice Elf Again. However, despite his creative genius and chart-topping success, Sly Stone encountered numerous financial setbacks throughout his career. Mismanagement of funds, lavish spending habits, and legal battles drained his finances over the years. Additionally, struggles with substance abuse further exacerbated his financial troubles. Despite efforts to revive his career and financial stability, including sporadic comeback attempts, Sly Stone ultimately faced homelessness and financial ruin. His story serves as a cautionary tale about the complexities of fame and fortune in the music industry. Number 10. Kelly Clarkson, a beloved singer and winner of the inaugural season of American Idol, experienced financial struggles despite her immense success in the music industry. Following her victory on the reality singing competition, 
Clarkson soared to stardom with hit singles like Since You've Been Gone and Because of You, establishing herself as a prominent figure in pop music. However, behind the glitz and glamour, Clarkson faced contractual disputes and legal battles with her management and record label, which significantly impacted her financial stability. Despite her continued musical achievements and endeavors, including hosting television shows and embarking on successful concert tours, Clarkson's financial woes persisted. The combination of expensive legal fees, ongoing financial disputes, and the pressures of maintaining a lavish lifestyle took a toll on her finances. Despite these challenges, Clarkson persevered, demonstrating resilience and determination in overcoming her financial setbacks and continuing to thrive in her career. Number 9. Jim Carrey, the renowned actor and comedian, encountered financial challenges despite his immense success in Hollywood. Known for his iconic roles in films like Ace Ventura, Pet Detective, The Mask, and Dumb and Dumber, Carey became one of the highest paid actors in the industry during the 1990s and early 2000s. However, despite his lucrative film contracts and box office success, Carey faced financial difficulties due to a variety of factors. His extravagant spending habits, combined with unexpected career setbacks and personal challenges, contributed to his financial woes. Additionally, Carey found himself embroiled in legal disputes and costly divorces, further straining his finances. Despite these setbacks, Carey continued to work diligently in the entertainment industry, diversifying his career with both comedic and dramatic roles. Through resilience and determination, Carey navigated through his financial struggles, demonstrating that even in the face of adversity, success can be rebuilt with persistence and hard work. Number 8. Margot Kidder, the acclaimed actress best known for her portrayal of Lois Lane in the Superman film series, faced significant financial struggles despite her successful acting career. Rising to fame in the late 1970s with her role opposite Christopher Reeve in the superhero franchise, Kidder's career appeared to be thriving. However, behind the scenes, she grappled with personal challenges, including bipolar disorder, which affected her ability to manage her finances effectively. Kidder's mental health struggles led to erratic behavior and financial mismanagement, ultimately resulting in bankruptcy in the 1990s. Despite her hardships, Kidder continued to work in the entertainment industry, albeit facing setbacks and limited opportunities. Her journey serves as a reminder of the importance of mental health awareness and the complexities that can accompany fame and success. Number 7. Oprah Winfrey, one of the most influential figures in the media industry, faced financial challenges early in her career before achieving massive success. Born into poverty, Winfrey endured a difficult childhood marked by abuse and hardship. Despite these early struggles, she persevered and began her career in broadcasting. In 1986, she launched The Oprah Winfrey Show, which became one of the highest-rated talk shows in television history. Winfrey's empire expanded rapidly with the success of her show, as she ventured into various media ventures, including publishing and film production. However, Winfrey's financial journey wasn't without its obstacles. She faced criticism and legal challenges throughout her career, including lawsuits and controversies that threatened her reputation and financial stability. Despite these challenges, Winfrey's resilience, business acumen, and philanthropic efforts propelled her to become one of the wealthiest and most influential women in the world, demonstrating that success can arise from adversity with determination and hard work. Number 6. Tiffany Haddish, the talented comedian and actress known for her breakout role in the movie, Girls Trip, 
encountered financial struggles early in her career despite her comedic success. Before gaining widespread recognition, Haddish faced periods of homelessness and financial instability, often living out of her car while pursuing her dreams in Hollywood. Despite her challenging circumstances, Haddish remained determined and resilient, honing her comedic skills through stand-up performances and auditions. Her big break came with Girls Trip, which catapulted her to fame and opened doors to various opportunities in the entertainment industry. However, even after achieving success, Haddish remained mindful of her financial responsibilities, prioritizing financial literacy and smart money management. Through hard work, perseverance, and a commitment to her craft, Haddish not only overcame her financial hardships but also emerged as a role model for aspiring comedians and performers, proving that with dedication and resilience, dreams can become reality. Number 5. Halle Berry, the esteemed actress and former fashion model, faced financial challenges despite her successful career in Hollywood. Rising to prominence in the 1990s with roles in films like Boomerang and Monsters Ball, for which she won an Academy Award, Berry became one of the highest paid actresses in the industry. However, despite her impressive earnings, Berry encountered financial difficulties due to various factors, including costly divorces and extravagant spending habits. Legal battles and investment losses further exacerbated her financial woes. Despite these setbacks, Barry remained resilient, continuing to pursue her acting career and exploring new opportunities in the entertainment industry. Through strategic financial planning and perseverance, Barry navigated through her financial challenges, demonstrating resilience and determination in overcoming obstacles. Her journey serves as an inspiration, highlighting the importance of financial literacy and responsible money management, even for those in the limelight. Number 4. Steve Harvey, a prominent television host, comedian, and actor, faced significant financial turmoil despite his immense success in the entertainment industry. Rising to fame with his stand-up comedy and later transitioning into television hosting, Harvey became a household name with shows like The Steve Harvey Show and Family Feud. However, behind the scenes, Harvey encountered financial setbacks due to various factors. One notable incident involved a costly divorce settlement, which took a toll on his finances. Additionally, business ventures and investments that didn't yield expected returns contributed to his financial struggles. Despite these challenges, Harvey remained resilient, working tirelessly to rebuild his financial stability. Through strategic partnerships, entrepreneurial endeavors, and a commitment to financial discipline, Harvey managed to overcome his financial setbacks and regain solid ground. His journey serves as a testament to the importance of resilience, financial literacy, and adaptability in navigating the complexities of wealth and fame in the entertainment industry. Number 3. Rocky Lockridge, once a celebrated professional boxer known for his remarkable skills in the ring, tragically fell into financial hardship and homelessness later in life. Rising to fame as a featherweight champion during the 1980s, Lockridge's boxing career was filled with success and accolades. However, after retiring from the sport, Lockridge faced a series of financial challenges that ultimately led to his homelessness. Mismanagement of funds, extravagant spending, and legal troubles drained his finances, leaving him unable to sustain his lifestyle. Additionally, Lockridge battled with substance abuse issues, which further exacerbated his financial woes and contributed to his downward spiral. Despite his past glory, Lockridge's later years were marked by struggles to make ends meet and find stable housing. His story serves as a poignant reminder of the fragility of financial stability and the importance of seeking support during challenging times.
Number 2. Erin Moran, best known for her role as Joni Cunningham in the iconic television sitcom, Happy Days, faced financial challenges and homelessness later in her life. Despite achieving fame and success as a child actress, Moran struggled with financial instability in adulthood. Following her time on Happy Days, Moran encountered difficulties in finding steady acting work, which led to financial strain. Additionally, personal struggles, including health issues and relationship problems, compounded her financial woes. Moran's financial difficulties eventually resulted in her experiencing homelessness towards the end of her life. Despite efforts to revive her career and stabilize her finances, Moran's challenges persisted, highlighting the harsh realities faced by some individuals in the entertainment industry. Number 1. Tyler Perry, the renowned actor, playwright, and filmmaker, experienced significant financial struggles before achieving immense success in the entertainment industry. Born into poverty and facing numerous challenges in his early life, including childhood abuse and homelessness, Perry persevered against the odds. Despite his talent and ambition, Perry faced rejection and financial hardship in his pursuit of a career in entertainment. However, he refused to give up on his dreams and began writing and producing his own stage plays, which eventually gained popularity among African-American audiences. Through sheer determination and ingenuity, Perry built his own entertainment empire, becoming one of the most successful and wealthiest figures in Hollywood. His story serves as a testament to the power of resilience, hard work, and unwavering belief in oneself, demonstrating that with perseverance and determination, even the most challenging circumstances can be overcome. Thank you for joining us as we uncovered the lesser-known side of fame and fortune in Hollywood. If you found these stories eye-opening, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to Hollywood Inside 1960s for more intriguing content. Your support keeps us going as we continue to explore the diverse facets of the entertainment industry. Stay tuned for our next episodes. Goodbye.